Hello again, it's Irina and welcome back to my garden. And right behind me uh, are my roses which I recently trimmed and I will show you a little update on them. Uh, they are really, spoiler alert, they are growing nicely so I'm very happy of that, for them. But I have a problem which I'm going to try to solve. So first of all, I can see them growing really nicely. Look at this beautiful new branches, new leaves. Uh, everywhere, even from, look, there even new branches are even growing from both sides. I am happy. The, look, I, I cut, I, le I left longer um, legs and look, one, two, three, four new branches are growing so beautifully. Uh, some of them are really, really long and try and starting to like really burst. But now there's a problem which I do not like. It's not a very big problem. It's a very common problem uh, in gardens, which is called aphids. I absolutely hate them. I don't know if you can see them. Let me check if I uh, zoom it really closely. You can see, oops, sorry, right here, a little nasty bug right here on the tip. I hate it. I hate the aphids. They suck energy. They suck the juice from my beautiful newly grown roses. They're trying to grow from, from this... Um, aggressive trimming I gave them and now they're eating them, I will not allow that. I don't want to do something very drastic like a roundup to kill the bees and stuff. So what I did here is I made a mix of, for, of um, uh, green soap. Uh, this is the, my, my sprayer. I use it for everything. Uh, it's really easy. I took um, for a gallon of water, I mixed two and a half um, uh, tablespoons of soap, uh, which uh, castel soap is the best they say, but uh, I used my um, gentle uh, dishwashing mm -hmm. soap and also two and a half spoons of uh, oil just so that it sticks better. And that's it. I just mixed it. So a gallon, two and a half uh, tablespoons of soap, two and a half tablespoons of um, oil. I mix it well, I shook it, and now I'm just gonna spray these aphids. Okay, let's start. I will, I'm trying, trying to spray like a harder bit so that I actually just wash them off as well. Uh, they like mostly. They like the. I'll, I'll spray the whole uh, plant, but they like and what they actually eat suck. Oh look how many! There are even four branches coming. Oh, I believe they're going to be so bushy. So they always suck the new sprouts, new branches. Look how many new branches are coming. They suck new branches because they're soft and easy to suck, I believe, from, uh, because they're rather small creatures. And also, they like uh, new flower, unopened flowers, flower blossoms as well, which I also have them on my hibiscus trees, and I'm going to do the same thing there. I hope that helps. Also, I just... Um, inspect my plants every day like the roses because I'm watching them growing like a maniac every day so I remove them with just my hands or if it's hibiscus I just try to wash them off with a, a hose but hopefully this application it's also an experimental I never did that before hopefully this will uh, like, you know, frighten them away, I hope. Yes, uh, you can try it too. It's, um, there's nothing to lose. It's easy to make. You don't have to buy anything from the store for this. 
and you can try it. I'm also uh, learning with you guys together. I'm. I was always had like a green thumb, you know. But uh, now I um, do the plants I never did bef did before. So yeah, I'm still learning. Just look what wonders the trimming make. Make so many. Look, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. It's branching so, so, so intensely. Look, and there are more here and here and here. Oh my goodness, I was so frightened doing this for the first time, but look. There's so many branches going in different directions. I can see from just one spot. They're going to be so bushy and cool. <laughs> I can't wait. And I do apply rose fertilizer. I only applied it once yet, but I'm going to do that weekly so that they're all well fed. So I believe I'm done here. Okay, this is my nice neighborhood. I believe I'm done here with this uh, roses. Uh, thank you for watching. I will update you guys uh, with my roses when they uh, are even more bushy than now. <laughs> I'll show you them blooming as well. Thank you for watching. Happy spring.